In this video, I'm going to show you where you could get the Windows Codex file. So if you have any problems running um, videos on a, let's say, a Windows Media Player or any other video player on uh, Windows 10 or Windows 11, then you might be missing a Codex file or the Codex file got corrupted or something. And you could get it on this website for free. You could buy the exact same thing on Microsoft Store, which is here. And on my, in Microsoft Store, it's called HEVC video extensions this is exact same file except you don't have to pay 99 cents for it but it does require you to have a gpu because uh, the free one is gpu based it says the free version only works on systems that have a graphics card that is capable of hardware acceleration coding of HEVC video so I think you have to have a pretty decent GPU maybe something like a GeForce RTX 3050 or above or the AMD equivalent of that so you could go here so this is a legitimate program this is not um, a program that you don't know about which could be malicious in any way so you just go to downloads here go to this website go to downloads and I recently had a problem with playing back some videos MPEG 4 videos so I downloaded this standard version and it works so what what a codec does is a codec file does is or program does is basically um, enables you to play different video formats like MPEG-2, MPEG, MP, MPEG-4, uh, .mov, and various video formats, AVI, .avi, and all these other formats. So if you don't have a Kodak or if the Kodak got corrupted, then if you play a video, then you won't see the picture you won't see the video which you may hear the sound so those are some of the problems that you will you will encounter and uh, if you try to edit a uh, video file like let's say an mpeg4 it's gonna have problems because it doesn't have the codex to uh, process that so I was having some issues with that and I was looking for a codec. I didn't want to download a a program that I didn't know, but this one is totally legit. And you shouldn't have any it shouldn't be malicious in any way. And that's all I want to share with you today. And thanks for